In a tweet dated November 23, 2023, Yaroslav Wolski announced a significant development in Poland's defense capabilities, focusing on an impending large-scale executive agreement for the purchase of Polish P-18PL mobile long-range early detection radars. This article delves into the subject. Developed by a consortium led by Pitradwar and the Military University of Technology, the P-18PL radar project, initiated in 2012, is now ready for integration into Poland's anti-aircraft and anti-missile defense systems. Designed to detect various threats, including conventional aircraft, those with low radar cross-sections, and ballistic targets, the radar serves both as a surveillance tool for surface-to-air missile systems and as an information source for integrated air defense systems. Its mobile design enhances survivability and operational flexibility. Capable of active and passive modes, and integrable with Link 16 and JRA PC networks, the P-18PL is a valuable addition to the Polish Wisla and Nehru air defense systems. Technically, the P-18PL has a 900 km range and operates in the VHF band. This frequency range extends its instrumental range and challenges enemy anti-radiation missiles. Its three-dimensional system, an advancement over its predecessor P-18, LoRa, provides crucial data on target flight altitude, thanks to the introduction of an active AESA, active electronically scanned array, antenna enabling digital formation of receiving beams in azimuth and elevation planes. The P-18PL's foldable, vehicle-mounted antenna ensures portability and rapid deployment. Its construction using semiconductor transmitting and receiving modules, based on commercially available transistors, enhances its efficiency and effectiveness. The radar also includes an IFF, identification, friend or foe, system for identifying friendly forces. The upcoming contract for the P-18PL radar not only marks a significant step in enhancing Poland's air defense capabilities but also indicates a commitment to technological advancement and self-reliance in defense capacities. Everyone is eagerly awaiting November 28, 2023, to access Yaroslav Wolski's interview with General Artur Kuptel about this contract, so stay tuned for Tuesday.